Hi guys, it's Ben here, and while Liverpool are set to make one more bid to try and sign Naby Keita from Leipzig, could Leon Goretzka from Schalke be a suitable alternative? So a day wouldn't be complete without another Naby Keita story, and of course more has come out today, this time from David Maddock from The Mirror. Maddock isn't the most unreliable guy in the world, he is Liverpool based, he knows the club, he has been reliable on this sort of stuff before. He says Liverpool are going to make one more attempt to sign Naby Keita from Leipzig, it's going to be a bid of at least £70 million. Keita is furious about what Ralph Ranić said about a whole village in Guinea advising him to move, so he is looking to push through the transfer he's been wanting to come all summer, and despite what Chris Bascom and Paul Joyce are saying, Liverpool may well still have one trick up their sleeve. Ranić has tried to talk himself out of the hole he's dug himself into with those comments. He's saying that he's got a great relationship with Keita, he's known him for a while. He says he's met a lot of players with an African background and they do sometimes have a whole village that live off the help of him and that's who wants him to move. He says his geography is good enough to differentiate between Guinea and Africa but Keita is still obviously less than impressed with that and Maddox says a bid could follow in the next week. He also says that Klopp is a fan of Leon Goretzka from Schalke. Now this is a player that a lot of you in the comments have been suggesting as an alternative. Renato Sanchez has been the other. Bayern Munich are the favourites to sign him but the Reds are clearly keen if Keita doesn't sign. This guy has played for Germany through all the youth levels and he's made nine senior appearances for the world champions. Now I've not seen much of Goretzka but I have seen some comparisons to Paul Scholes. If he's half the player he is then what a player he obviously will be. He scores a lot of goals from distance, his passing is very good. He could also play deeper or on the wing which I know Klopp likes that sort of versatility. We've seen Junior Wijnaldum deployed in various areas, Lallana and Coutinho too. He made 39 appearances for Schalke last season scoring seven goals so a solid return. Clearly one of their best players over the last two seasons, hence Bayern's interest. He's the same age as Keita at 22, so playing in the same league, Keita obviously that step up, but perhaps a good alternative if we can't get Renato Sanchez either. Meanwhile, James Pearce has settled all of our nerves regarding Philippe Coutinho. He says he took part in training today, looked very happy there, was playing well, showing absolutely no discontent, there's nothing wrong in the camp. Jurgen Klopp's reiterated that he loves the club and feels comfortable there, and the club maintained that he's absolutely not for sale, when, and that's exactly what I want to hear. Spanish newspaper Sport has said earlier on that we had put a £134 million price tag on the midfielder. I'm sorry, but even that for me isn't worth it. I'm also sure that story is very false. We cannot serve as players. I think the owners are smart enough to know that. As much as a lot of you guys hate them and don't want to give them any credit, I think they're too smart to sell Coutinho this summer unless he absolutely pushes for a move, which I can't see him doing. He does seem happy. There's obviously a bit of concern when Barcelona come calling for one of your players. It's hard to not ex expect him to have his head turned at some point. But I think this year will be fine. Maybe next year we can start panicking. But this is the season to be most worried about. And Coutinho does seem happy. He's not going to push for a move. We're fine, as far as I'm concerned, at the moment. Leave a comment if you've seen Leon Goretzka play before. What do you know about and how much would he improve Liverpool's team? Is he a good alternative Naby Keita or are you still all in on the Leipzig midfielder joining Liverpool for around £70 million? Pounds? Hope you enjoyed the video guys. Please do subscribe to my channel for more of this sort of stuff. Drop a like, share the video for me and follow my other socials if they might say on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook and I'll see you next time.